Well, one last thing. This will be the finale to the donkey carving series, but just one last thing I needed to come on here and show because finally I found the little burning tip that shades and just going to do a last demonstration of how we're going to shade in the little insides of its ears. So that's what we're doing this time around, putting the little shade in, make the ears so they're going to be a little good for what we do and what we make and see how this little critter is making its way up to the point that we can kind of shade him in and make him so he's going to be a beautiful little creature once we get him done and once we get done working in him and make him a little special character of a animal that kind of resembles and sees what we all want to resemble and see and come down to where it's going to be showing up in the little ears we make and how it's going to kind of come along to where it's going to be just the creature to fit into the very nativity it's designed for and I say I say that there's a little thing I'm thinking about next I've found a piece of buckeye that I think is going to be good for carving a little angel out of and think that that's going to be what we'll use for the little angel in the next little video series and it's going to be something we'll carve out a little at a time using our thoughts our brains our minds and our imaginations and come up with the little ways we do it at the very moment we do it and just work it how we kind of make it come about to see what we're going to need it to be when we all get done with what we do and I say I say that this is just kind of like working itself making it so we're kind of making a lot of good out of what we do and have and see in this life and I tell y'all that I can't wait until the day comes that I might get those particular pieces sawn out get around to making the video where you get to see me carve into them and make a little wonder work out of that and oh the things you're going to see in my work and all that I do and all the ways it all comes about and as for now that was just a little quickie I made and it's probably about time that we just kind of come close here. I want to thank those of you who decided to come on here and watch this series and learn from it and see all the things I can do and the ways I make it and that you would always just kind of continue to stay tuned to this channel, watch many more of my videos, learn much more. I do have a little thing to mention to you about these little shepherds that I carved back in the other nativity series and how that, um, you know, I have like all these knitting needles. I bought a whole bulk of them because I use them to turn my stuffed animals out and I am just always mislaying these. They're just always vanishing. So many things I have to do and so I had to buy a whole bulk of them and have a whole jar full of them to use and since I had so many of them, decided that I'd cut off the ends of them or cut them in half to make these little shepherd rods to go with these little Guanacosti shepherds here which are going to be in part of the nativity scene and for all I've already shown you all as far as what I already do and what I've already done that's just one more addition I'd like to share with you that I've made and of all things all the more I'd like to continue to show how things are going to come along just fine and be at the center of the attention of the work and then come the time when I'm going to get it all together and show you all more 
I do want to say that if it so interests you, I would appreciate if you would subscribe to this page. Help me get a little bit more subscribers so that I can network a little bit more. Help us get a little better audience so that we can kind of do a little more and show a little more, see a little more, and have a little bit more to say. And I'd say that hopefully when this audience gets bigger and better, we're going to have more to show, more to do. And thank you all again for coming on and seeing the work. And thank you all for watching. And while this series comes to its finale, I will see you in the next.